Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Jay. And I'm Day. Welcome to Puff Puff Pass. A phenomenal cannabis review show. Today we're going to be smoking some GMO, a little bit different. We got a 0.55 pack from Carolina's Cannabis in Uxbridge, Mass. They are packaged by Carolina's Cannabis in Hopedale, Mass. The TAC was 30.4%. It cost $30 for this little pack. Nifty packaging as well. Where, oh, there we go. <laughs> Beautiful. Slides right open. Pop it out. You got these little babies right inside. Fantastic. We're excited to try there this. We are, we are. Well, and um, Caroline. Well, You're going to say it? That it's woman. It's a woman owned cannabis place. 100% woman owned. It's very cool. I've had GMO before. Okay. It's uh, definitely one of my favorites. It's definitely a strong strain for heavy smokers. I feel like if you're a new smoker, this would be a, a nice slapper. Let you into the field. It's super skunky. Mm. Oh. Right away. Oh, it's making me sneezy a little bit. <laughs> yeah, right off the bat, GMO always hits. It's it's always a hitter. I like it. Me too. It's cute that they're little babies. I'm not generally a big fan of the little baby joints, but because there's five of them, I'm okay with it. There Ooh, it's very spicy. Yeah, and it was a good weight. I believe they were 7.4, right, AJ? Pretty, yeah, I think, like, yeah, 7.3, 7.5. We only weighed two because we're impatient, and we wanted to try them. <laughs> yeah, this is super strong. It's a little bit spicy. It's definitely a one-hit-to-happiness kind of, Jay, for sure. At least for me, it is. <laughs> I wonder if the, it tastes different because we've let it sit a little bit because we wanted to do a it video be, for yeah. it. Because I don't remember it being this spicy. Aged like spicy wine instead of fine wine. Aged like spicy wine. I like it. Very inviting cannabis shop. Very nice employee. Oh, oh, it's so cute. The ladies were super adorable. And boys do work there. It's not... <laughs> and they're allowed in. We were making that joke. But <clears throat> super rustic, super cute, impressive selection. The whole menu, the entire menu is handwritten in like really beautiful chalk. That's awesome. It's, it was so fun. I really enjoyed going in. And I went to the one in Uxbridge. Yeah, it's right off uh, 140, I think. Nice. It was nice and they were helpful and... How was the parking? Ample parking. That's, yeah, that's a big thing for me. There was a stupid amount of parking. Sweet. And they didn't have like a reception area. You just walked in. The one girl stand at the door. She scanned you. And then a foot away, the other girl stand right there to take your order. And she scanned you. It was a very, very cute store. That's fantastic. Yeah. And being a woman, I do like to support other women. I'm nice like that. Mm, I'm getting a little, little cheeky. Not much else. I personally got some sweaty palms already. Like I said, for me, GMO is a one-hit wonder or one-hit to happiness. I hit it. I kind of bite down and clench in my jaw. I don't know why. I think it's the skunky spice flavor in there. I don't know. It's got to be the spice because I do a similar, like, kind of clench the back of your... Definitely thing. a very happy and uplifting strain. Oh, and this is Futurola? The, Fancy. Yeah, we use... Uh, what do we use? Oh, Mystic. Mystic. Yeah. yeah, we love Mystic. This one's good though. Maybe also we've come across that the paper can sometimes be spicy. Absolutely. Because I don't, GMO's not usually spicy for me. It's a pretty strong skunk though. Yeah, but it's not a, it's like It's usually a, a cough for you, right? It's usually a cough in yeah. Not like a dead person coughing. <laughs> coughing. Yeah. <laughs> not a coffin. Can yeah. I tell him stuff? <laughs> it's getting me a little bit. I'm getting cheeks, but I'm not like. It's uplifting. Was it's it a like... hybrid? Or was... It's an indica. GM was an indica? Yeah, I picked it up from other places and it said it's a hybrid <laughs> indica. It's not like this place is just straight indica. But... Just depends on the phenotype. Yeah, I guess so. The it's, phenomenal It's phenotype. very relaxing and uplifting. Like, I don't feel like I'm going to fall asleep or anything like that. Not at all. I'm not getting indica. That's why I thought, yeah, yeah definitely a hybrid. I like it though. It's getting less spicy the further down we go, which is different. It's usually the opposite. Such a, it's such a weird name. Uxbridge? Just, Uxbridge? It just throws me off. I know, it was like... What'd two, you call it? Uno Bridge? It was like two minutes ago and it's still in my head. I'm like, did I say that right? Damn. 
<laughs> you did. Definitely gave me like tingliness on my nose. So far, it's just like the guy, <laughs> it's just a funny pressure back here. <laughs> Get more loosey goosey though. All right, we're gonna smoke two joints because they're half grams. And we smoke a gram on this fucking show. <laughs> right? It's a, sometimes it's spicy, sometimes it's not. Yeah. Did you see what's on Jay's shirt? It's just skulls. It's so cute! <laughs> you gotta find one with little joints. I was gonna look for little pot leaves. Little, like, the they be pot leaves. Little joints would be <laughs> good too. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Pardon me. Whew. It's making me a little mm -mm that too. A little cop mouth. <laughs> God about the game. Oh shit. Old school. Yep, this stuff is definitely fantastic. <coughs> I never get cop mouth. That's funny. All I know is that I didn't need right. a full gram to get slapped off this. I feel pretty good. I could smoke. I more feel pretty that. good. Yeah. I want to smoke more, but I want yeah. to be stoned. These five packs are definitely, uh, you know, cute, I think is the best way to put it. <coughs> it's like replacing cigarettes. Yeah, pretty much. They need to put 20 or 30 in there, though. Or They're know. getting there. I saw a 10-pack the other day. Or you got a 60-pack. No. You should. 60-pack. Oh, I thought packs. you said you saw one. I'm like, no. Like the, the <laughs> Chinese thing. Yeah. The They're like 100 pack. That would be fun. I'm all for that. Now, don't forget... Like and subscribe. Please and thank you. Please and thank you. And um and I'm trying to we're trying to come up because I believe our fans, our support base of Jeez. awesomeness. You guys. Deserves a name. And I everybody uses high society, so fuck that. Let's think of a cool different one. Let us know in the comments down yeah. below. What what should our name be? Your name be. The name of the Puff Puff Pass followers be. Ooh. Right? I can't think of anything. I'll start at your nails. <sighs> Happens every now and then. What would you give it? I think it's a 10. Mm. You can't really, you sad. have to suck to not be a 10. Weed is amazing. This is good weed. You know how I feel about the little baby joints. Yeah. I never like little baby joints, but. Yeah. I'm definitely giving it a 10. It's up in the top areas, you know, 30% is really nice. It seems to be what the norm is. I don't know about where you guys are. Let us know what the norm is for you guys in your state, but yeah. where we are right now, it seems to be like 30s, and honestly, we have some other stuff we've picked up that is 40%. And that just, that's just going up. Me away. Just, just me away. I just posted. Yep. Miracle Bits was like 41.8 something. Yep. Look at that video. Yep, absolutely. <laughs> it's a little crazy. They're just going up and up. It's <laughs> Yeah, it is. 20 used to be high. I remember when 20 was high. Mm -hmm. I probably Absolutely. took like a million hits. I want to smoke the other one. Right? This is the baby. I don't think I have a thorough no. analysis. Show them how you do that. This thing is stupid. I don't like it. But that it's the best uh, probably way they can do it. But my finger gets stuck. Little cigarette box. Mm -hmm. 0.5 gram, 5 pack. Is that an 8? 5 times 0.5? 2, 2. No, it's only 2.5. For 30. I feel like that's a little pricey. But it wasn't a sale day or anything. Yeah. That's another thing, you guys. Always check out those sales. Everybody's got sales. Every shop's a little bit different. And everybody has uh, loyalty points. Yeah, really cool. Can pay? Jeez. Can pay is cool, but like... Where we go, uh, often we go to Ethos, and they give you a point for every dollar. And then they give you, for a thousand points, it's a hundred bucks off. That's badass. Very nice. <laughs> because this is, I think, our second, it's like rent, weed, groceries. No. Yeah. Yeah. My elbow just cracked. Did you hear that? I thought it was a chair. Where's my elbow? Jesus. Fuck. Didn't feel it. I just, just like getting hurt. old. Yeah. Does anybody know how? Have we mentioned how old you are? Does anybody know how old Jay is? We just said how old I was because it was my birthday. Mm. But how old do we think Jay is? Old. 
ancient. <laughs> He's a cradle robber. <laughs> wow. Not what I want to be known for here. <laughs> All right. I'm sticking with my 10. I like GMO. This would be the second half of the joint for us now. It's setting in. Yeah, this is where it should be. <coughs> I was getting discouraged because I'm seeing the joint. It's like little and I'm not stoned. <laughs> so I get worried. But no, yeah, we need a full gram between us. So I felt it right away, but that's just me personally. Weed affects you everybody love differently. GMO, though. And you're I a little bit GMO. allergic. He's allergic to weed. Maybe that makes you stoned quicker. I don't know. Maybe it'll kill me quicker. <laughs> Why are you going to go there? I don't know. Fucking skull boy. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to re-review it. Strong, <laughs> skunky, smell, taste. It hits you right away. If you're a new smoker, this is going to be a great strain for you to like <laughs> step up a level because you want to step up into something higher yeah, shit. This is, this is going to be a good one because it's happy and uplifting. A median smoker. Yep, and it's pretty relaxing as well. So I think, you know, anybody can smoke this. And then strong, heavy-duty guys, they're going to love it always. If you don't know what GMO is, go pick up GMO. Definitely. I'm getting a good day. It's a good daytime for heavy smokers and a good nighttime for new to intermediate smokers. Absolutely. Yeah. Stuff's great. Because it's chill and nice. Yeah. And a little low. But I can still go cook something or go do something. Not that I want to, but I could. But I don't want I to. Feel yeah. I feel go garden. Yeah. God. A chill, like. Were you asking that or are you just. I don't know. Probably. I think I had to. I forget. I'm feeling it now. I'm totally good. Yeah, right? Just It was just like that... What? Hack the joint is like, if we're usually at 20, it's like getting to 11 hits is like right where we need to be. Yeah. And then past that is always just... <laughs> <coughs> GF... Oh, Oof. all right. We almost forgot because we haven't recorded in... A while. I have a description to read. What is the GMO strain? Oh, oh, it's like a little. Oh, it's not a description. It's like a, like a learning from way to leap. So many believe GMO weed to be the baby of divine genetics. Divine genetics primarily creates super strong skunk aimed at experienced smokers, and GMO certainly meets the criteria. Doubt is cast into the strain's origin because the company doesn't reveal its operation base or where they created their strains. Wow. As such, several other breeds, breed creators have laid claim to GMO, including Lumico Seeds and breeder called <laughs> Skunk Master Flex. I like it. Leaving its origins <laughs> unclear. Uh, we're confident that its genetic lineage is an indica dominant hybrid strain created by crossing Girl Scout cookies and Chemdog. Why did I think it was alien cookies? I don't know. Unsurprisingly, combining these two gives us some heavy hitting monster skunk. Blah, 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 blah. It smells. At first, what we are about to describe may seem a bit off putting, but trust us, it isn't. <laughs> <laughs> That's accurate. Alright, swamp. Yep, swampy. Big inhale, blah, blah, blah. This is very wordy. It vintage fabric and moth balls. That's funny. But it, it is all <laughs> reminiscent of it. Like an old dusty attic. Yeah. That's, yeah. Yeah, perfect. Absolutely. And then when you grind it up, like garlic cookies, oh, you have garlic we're cookies. Super good. That's what you're saying. <laughs> right? They found it in the attic? Or am I thinking of something else? No, they found it in the attic. Those kids snooping around. That was a sick attic, though. Remember that window? It had that big circle. And then the spiders. Ooh. Just... There. Ooh. Not the spiders, but yeah. That'd be fun. So, that's a lot of info, and I'm not going to keep reading, because, yeah, I'll post up the link, and you can read about GMO off of Way to Leaf. No affiliation, just that's who we picked, because they were the best one. That's a real pretty picture. I'll put that up, too. So, that was cool. Hell, yeah. We didn't have any... Did you look on Carolina's website? I did. They didn't have... No, they didn't. But thank you, Carolina's Cannabis, for this great GMO that you guys procured. Carolina's And cannabis. packaged. Good it job. Multiple servings. Good job. They have a website we'll also post up. Whoop-a-dode. It says right on the back. That's cool. Get a 10 for me. 
Yeah, I'm 10, 10, pass. pass, pass. I like it. <clears throat> Please pick it up. Yeah, they didn't have, I would have got an eighth, but they only had, when I asked for like a house bud, they only had the, that. So, we got two more joints too we're going to do, so look for those. And Sweet. Yeah. 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 Okay, we're good. We, we hope you enjoy your eye. Ah, the good one. <clears throat>